Good day. Welcome to our math class. Today's lesson is about quadratic equation. So, ano ba ang quadratic equation? It is an equation with a degree of 2. Let's try to break down first the definition. So, we have here the first word, equation. So, ang una nating titingnan sa given ay kung ito ba ay may equal sign. So, therefore, kung walang equal sign ang given, automatically, hindi na siya quadratic equation. And the second part of the definition is degree of 2. Ano ba yung degree of 2? When we say degree of 2, or when we say degree, so it has something to do with the exponent. Ang tanong is exponent ng ano? So in quadratic equation, we're going to take a look at the exponent of the variable. So take note po yun ha. Ang titingnan lang po natin para malaman kung quadratic equation is yung exponent or yung titingnan natin is the exponent of the variable. So kung ang exponent ng number ay 2, so no bearing yun. So wala siyang bearing kung ang given ay quadratic equation or not. So exponent of the variable. Ngayon, degree of 2 ang nakalagay dito sa definition ng quadratic equation. Dapat, ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable ay 2. So, for it to be a quadratic equation, so, dapat may equal sign at dapat, ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable ay 2. Okay. So, let's have first examples. So, number 1, or first, so we have x squared equals to 8. Ito ay example ng quadratic equation. Nasatisfy natin yung first condition, so we have equal sign. And of course, hindi pwedeng may equal sign lang. So, dapat meron siyang left part and then right part. Kasi kung ang given ay x squared is equal, so hindi po yan quadratic equation. So, may equal sign siya. Ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable ay 2. Pero still, hindi siya quadratic equation. So, that may left part at saka may right part. The first example is a quadratic equation. So, may equal sign. And the highest exponent of the variable is 2. So, wala na namang ibang variable dyan. So, ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable is 2. So, check to. Quadratic equation. So, the next one is 3x squared minus 2 equal to 0. So, may equal sign, check. And of course, the highest exponent of the variable again is 2. So, quadratic equation. The last example, we have x squared plus 3x plus 9 equals to 5. Again, may equal sign, check. And then here, nag-appear ng twice ang variable. We have x squared, we have 3x. So, kailangan natin i-check yun kung ilang best nag-appear yung variable. Kasi i-check natin yung mga exponent ng mga yon. So, ang unang um, exponent ng variable here in our first term ay 2. Yung pangalawa naman, so ano kaya exponent nyan? Wala naman nakalagay. But, in math, if we have here variable, automatic meron niyang 1 na exponent. So, we have here 1. So, ito ay 1. Now, we have 2 and 1 na exponent ng variable. So, ang pinakamataas ay 2. Still, ito ay quadratic equation. Because the degree of this equation is 2. So, ito yung mga example na quadratic equation. Let's proceed now to non-examples. We have here 7x plus 9 equal to 0. So, ito po ay hindi quadratic equation. Bakit? Well, nasatisfy niya. Meron tayong equal sign. But, the degree of this equation is not equal to 2. Dahil ang pinakamataas na exponent neto ay 1. So, 1 lang siya. And we call this a linear equation. So, kapag 1 ang degree ng equation, so that is linear equation. So, this is not an example of quadratic equation. Next, we have 3x cube plus 2x squared minus 3 equals to 9. Again, this example is not 
a quadratic equation. Kung mapapansin nyo, yes, may equal sign again. And then we have here 2x squared. Oops. So meron tayong x squared. But kaya hindi pa rin siya quadratic equation. So that is because of the our of our first term. Ang first term natin is 3x cubed. And nag-exceed na tayo sa degree of 2. Ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable now is 3. So that is not a quadratic equation. So ang degree ng equation na ito ay 3. So hindi siya quadratic equation. Last example is x squared plus 8x minus 1. Medyo tricky. Pero ito ay hindi quadratic equation. So, for our students, hindi siya quadratic equation. So, mukha lang siya quadratic equation. So, kung mapapansin natin, ang pinakamataas na exponent ng variable ay 2. So, ang exponent ng variable dito ay 2. Ang exponent ng variable ay 1. So, of course, ito no variable. So, exponent ng variable here is 0, of course, kasi walang variable. So, 0. So, degree na itong given ay 2. Pero bakit hindi siya quadratic equation? Dahil wala siyang equal sign. So, this is not a quadratic equation. So, hindi siya quadratic equation. This is an expression. But this is not an equation. So, we can call this quadratic. But not quadratic equation. So, magkaiba yun. So, ito ay quadratic expression. So, we are talking about quadratic equation. So, that's it for the introduction of quadratic equation. So, we have the examples and then examples. So, I hope ngayon alam nyo na kung paano nyo i-identify kung ang given ba ay quadratic equation or not.